Alright, whatever, gameplay. Uh, I'm not sure if we started the video yet, but... We're playing Mario Party 6! Well, I'm playing, he's just watching me, because technology is sucks. But it's not there yet, man. Not uh, yet. Party with Mario and the gang all day and in, in, into the night. Well, it's 1.17 a.m. right now, so not we much day. We already missed the day, man, yeah. That shit's gone. Oh, yeah, let's just Game skip that. Gone. Does that mean we can sequence break this? Fuck. The day! Sequence break a Mario Party game. Sequence break my bot. Oh, uh, hey, Hudson. Don't they yeah, make something Hud else? Hudson's pretty awesome. They made Mylon Secret Castle, which was a terrible game, but... Okay, who cares about the story of Mario Party? Now, uh, anyway. Mario Party, yes! Hell <laughs> fucking yeah. All right, man. Oh, they've got a day and night thing going on there. I see. Okay. Yeah, okay. that's the whole concept of this game, basically. Because you never play this, right? Um, if I did, it, uh, yeah, I don't think I have. Okay, so the basic concept is that the moon and the sun are fighting, and you've got to collect enough stars to stop them from fighting. Wow. Get it? All right. So you just got to get enough stars to bribe them to shut up. Okay. Exactly. Yeah. Mario wow. Mario's teaching bribery teaching? since. Whenever the first game came out, like 1946, whatever, I don't know. What a but, douche. Uh, welcome to party mode. Yeah, so this isn't going to be any LP official style thing, it's just going to be another LMAO essentially. In case you were Grand wondering. Pumps. All right, I did fair square last time, I'll let you pick. Do you want to do Towering Treetop, Egad's Garage, Snowflake Lake, Castaway Bay, or Clockwork Castle? Uh, Snowflake, the Snowflake one. All right. That's Snowflake Lake. You have terrible taste, that's the most boring one. Whatever. No, it's not, it's the funnest one. Alright, oh, we gotta pick a character. I picked Boo before, so, I don't know. Wow, so many characters. I'm going Boo. That Toadad, oh my god. Yeah, she was a computer on the last board. Fuck, so. Toadad, man. Who do you want? Well, I'll let you do the computers. Yoshi. Alright. Um, Daisy. Okay. Daisy Dukes. And, uh, Bowser Jr. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're, they call him Koopa Kid in this game. Really? Yeah. It's kind of ridiculous. So, so it could just be any generic Koopa Kid, but it's no, obviously it's not any of the other ones except, like, freaking Bowser Jr. Yeah. Sucking the pee pee all day long. You only oh, man, want. This one does look boring. Hmm? This does look pretty boring. Like a boring man. <laughs> You only wanted to play this one because it's just hot as hell. You just need yeah, the snow to relieve yourself, right? My balls are literally sweating right now, as we speak. <laughs> I'm sure the whole world could have gone the rest of their lives without knowing about your ball sweat. But you just had to chime And that would have been that. a tragedy, so that's why I'm here to give this information. Oh, whatever, I'm going third. Save lives, man. You know. Save lives, one teardrop at a time. And by teardrop, I mean ball sweat bead. Ball sweat for the win. Oh, by the way, all the computers are on brutal difficulty, so this will be fun. They're gonna kick your ass. I, I guess yeah. I'm guessing uh, Bowser BJ is gonna win the entire game. All right, there's <laughs> you're the freaking computer for this one, I guess. The BJ's rooting on. I'm rooting for BJ. Yeah. And by the way, the gimmick with this board, since every board has to have one, is that everyone starts with five stars, and you go around paying money at Chain Chomps to steal them from people. Wow, that's... that's crazy, actually. It's pretty it's pretty rad, yeah. Do you get more... is it possible to get more stars? Except, except no, no, the max no. stars in this board is like 20, between all four of us, so... Unless you set a handicap for yourself, which is just retarded. But I mean, there's like no squares you can land on that give you stars, you just have to steal them? No, no, yeah, you have to steal them. Okay, that's interesting. Right. Damn it, he already took one of the bananas, that's not fair. What a douche! DK stands for douche. Cripple! I have, to, I have to remember that I'm not Yoshi here. Oh, fuck, I landed in the water already! Fucking Yoshi. God, look you how good they me. are. Wow. Who won? Uh, I don't know when we all get coins, but... I guess Bowser Jr. got the most. BJ pulling through. Pulling uh. out with the BJs. BJs all day. Oh uh, yeah, this damn it, I'm so in third now, look at that. How could they have deviated this far from Mario Party 4? It's just wrong. <laughs> well, this is two games later, so a lot can happen in two sequels, I guess. Damn it, How what the hell? They? 
I like, I really didn't even know Toadette existed in this, like, I thought Mario, Mario Kart Wii was the first instance of Toadette. Nah, she was here pretty soon. What are you doing, Hazard? Okay, whatever. Has she been in any other games since this one? She's probably in a tennis game or something, I don't know. Hmm. It's weird. I don't know, but Toadette, yeah, Toadette's just this weird, like, random character. Just for the sake of being there, I guess. Probably just as fucking useless as the regular toads. Yeah, pretty much, and we all know how sucky they are. They don't do shit. They see, you know who they need in this game? Guppy. That's what they need. Oh, hell yeah. Too bad this is on the GameCube and that was on the Wii. That's oh, alright. Oh, man, look how slow my platform is. This is bullshit. I'll take a slightly 2D. Well, that's because you're in the front, so you can just block them, anybody from getting any. You just ride in front of somebody the whole time and just fuck them. <laughs> True enough. Well, I'm, I'm, I can't, I'm not actually controlling the way I go. I'm just controlling like when I shoot. So. Oh. Oh, it's a one v three. Okay, you're just trying to kill Bowser Jr. Is all you're yeah, doing. Yeah, and he is good at this apparently. I thought there were like. Oh, we got him. Down. Two seconds left. Damn. All you have to do is hit him Fuck once. Fuck you, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> well, Damn. you saw how hard it was to hit him. So. You know what mini game I like? I can't remember what game that's on though. I think it's. What game is that on? Oh, never mind. That's not Shrek Super Party, so you wouldn't know. What the hell? Shrek Super Party, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the game everyone's played. Right. It's like, uh, it's on the Xbox. It's like, it's basically like you're standing on this thing, and there's you have a target that you control, and it can go left or right a certain amount of degrees, and people, like, their things move in the trajectory, their things, and they have to throw them and, like, hit the target, and it makes you fall in the water. It's You have to see it, but it's good. It's that fun. sounds incredibly boring. It sounds like you need like a protractor for that, like angles. Like what's that? No, you just move it left and right, and it goes along the angles. It's oh, not. It doesn't actually okay. have anything to do with it. So that. it's like that one mini game in Wind Waker, where it's just like angles, but you don't have to do anything. Um, sure. Let's you just have go. No idea what I'm talking about. Zero idea what you're talking about. By the way, do you know what these orbs are in this game? Orbs. Orbs, no. yeah. Are those items? What is that? Yeah, they're like orbs that you get and you can use them to like modify things. There's a whole bunch. There's like 25 different orbs or so. And you and can what just it, like they modify things. They can like you can like use them on spaces so that when people land on them or pass those spaces, that uh, good that interesting stuff happens. Okay. And do you choose what it does or does it just random? Uh, well, it tells you what it does when you first get it, and you can like buy them from the shops. That's what the shops do in this game: sell orbs instead of like items. Man, this Mario Party is weird. It is. I'm so, so good at this game. Are you ready? I'm going to dominate this. Oh my god. Okay. You, if you say so, man. There's supposed to be brutal difficulty, though. I don't know. Yeah, this one can is... It uses the, like, analog stick and the C-stick, though. So. Damn. It's kind of weird. I blame Look at that Goomba man. wearing a bow tie. <laughs> Was it just the first one to put in the commands? Or the no, last one is, like... No, it's like uh, it gives you a certain amount of time to put in the commands. Oh. And if you get it wrong, and it gets like faster with each round. Okay. It's easy enough to grasp. It's so simple, a caveman could do it, really. I get it. This reminds me of a, a certain person's limit break in Final Fantasy VIII, actually. <laughs> really? Yeah. Is it Orin? It's just. No. <laughs> God damn it. It's Zell. Zell dinched. What the hell is that? His, his uh, thing is like, it's called Duel, and basically you run up and you just gotta press, they give you like a list of three moves, and you gotta like press the button combinations as quickly as you can, and then you get like a new list of three moves, and it keeps giving you new moves, and you gotta keep pressing the button combos, and you have like ten seconds. Oh to put shit, I fucked up. <laughs> oh god. Oh, you're dead. You I got got, Yeah, I fell through a hole into the center of the earth. Damn. That's brutal, man, just for losing a minigame. Yeah, well, Mario Party doesn't play around, you know? You saw, like, this freaking Bowser bombs, like, they bombs. What does Daisy say when she wins? Did she say, hi, I'm Daisy? No, she said, oh, yeah, I won. <laughs> like, all, <laughs> like, what? nasally, like that. Like, it's like, she's sick, and she, why is she playing? Why is she in this freaking, like, snowy landscape if she's sick? I don't know, but she's dominating, apparently. Yeah, apparently, 41. She's got five stars already, look at that. Yeah, what a, a slut bag. Uh, but so do I. So. Man, my boy Bowser Jr. is in last place. What yeah, the I'm fuck, DJ? Oh, yeah, 10, finally. Oh, what the shit is that? Is that, like, random? 
That was a. Or was that a trap? Bowser Jr. put like a thing there that like well, screwed what you a over. Dick hole. Piranha plant orb. I don't want that. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's see the board. Can I like, use this my advantage? Oh yeah. Screw these guys up. What does this do? Like fuck people up who are in your path? This is how you get stars: is you pay the chain chomp. What the shit? No. And he like rides a certain number of spaces, and if you pass anyone, you steal a star from them. Oh. Uh, of course, I had uh, to get one though. So. What I can you roll up to ten? Oh uh, yeah, this, there's like certain chain chomps that you can like pay like just ten coins, and like then you re up to roll one die up to ten or whatever. But there's certain ones that you can pay like up to thirty coins and roll three dice. Damn, like a mega mushroom. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. sick. Oh, this is lame. I like how there's like a skeleton under the ice there, though. It's kind of interesting. Is it not Captain Keita? <laughs> it does so look like him. Keita! We know where this fits in the Zelda timeline then, huh? Oh, yeah. Fucking years in. Well, I mean, he's kind of small. I guess it could be before when he was a wee baby. Ah, true enough. You know, uh, this reminds me of reminds me of that guy you fight in Twilight Princess, that skeleton guy, because the arena kind oh, of. Oh, that's my like, favorite boss. That's my second favorite boss in all Zelda games. I think that's my favorite boss in all Zelda. It's so like, what is he like the super like boss Stalfos or something? He's like his so name is cool. Star Lord. Yeah, Star Lord. Yeah, he is. That boss fight is so fun. I haven't even done it, and it's so fun. He's like, the most kick ass thing ever. Yeah. And I mean, the spinner is just epic. It is. Speaking of spinners. Uh. Oh no. This well, this is pretty self explanatory this minigame I guess. Yeah. What the f oh my god, they got that really fast. Fifteen seconds! Fifteen uh, seconds! I guess that's what I get when I choose brutal. Yeah, they are have oh, you ever chose fuck. brutal before? Yeah, I think I chose brutal on my last LMAO. Did they did they win? Apparently. Yeah, I think I came in like dead dead last in that one. <laughs> Damn. Oh well. Koopa At least Koopa Kid? Kid's starting to win. He's your money. He's a fucking Koopa Kid, man. Mm, if he's not he Koopa is, Kid, then he what is, is he? He always will be BJ. BJ. Oh yeah, it okay, it's nighttime now, which means that Frieza Coles appear on the pass. Whatever. They just well, block those your those guys path. from Smash Brothers Brawl. And New yeah, Super Mario Brothers Wii. Yeah, true enough. Mm, yeah, Yoshi. You go away. Roll back to the... start. You don't this win is why online. I like like Mario Party 4 because like these ones just seem so complicated. There's just so many different things. There are a lot of different things that happen, but yeah, it's just so. I much don't know. Going it spices on. things up and makes it entertaining to the eyes. True. I can just. That's why I just. I look at Mario Party 9. I just look at like screen or videos of that, and I'm just like, fuck that. <laughs> oh my god, that one just looks convoluted as balls. Seriously. See, there's my orb. It's gonna go right there. Yes. Oh, wait, now I got ten, nine coins out of it. Damn. Damn. What the hell is this? I'm gonna switch you with Koopa Kid on the double? Koopa Kid doesn't exist, apparently, so. Koopa Kid, he doesn't come in a jar. Koopa Kid Koopa comes, comes from Mario Party. I guess. A Freezy is blocking the path. Shit. Damn, Freezy. Are there um, bonus stars in here? Like, you know, if you land on certain spaces? Uh, no. Not, I, obviously like, not in this like, map, but are there usually? No. Well, like, there's like star spaces, yeah, like you can get stars and stuff. There's like weird ways to get stars on some of the boards. Normally it's pretty normal, though. Is this like the first four player minigame we've had? Holy shit. Catch you letter? Catch you letter, yeah, this is a game about postage. So, uh,. Well, now that Zelda Wind Waker game, I would understand. Like, that reference I would get. Oh, of course, because everyone hates that one for some reason. I don't know why. It looks really hard, but I haven't played it in ages, so I don't remember. It's really it. easy, but people are bad at it. People suck yeah. at video games, that's the thing. I don't know why. Especially, it seems like a lot of people suck at Wind Waker, too. I don't know why. I don't know. It's so fun. Okay, maybe it's because a lot of people hate it. Get the love letter! What the f- I think they hate it because they suck at it. Exactly. <laughs> like, man, this is bullshit. It's like the easiest Zelda game ever, too. Except maybe Skyward Sword, I don't know. Yeah. Ah. Uh, oh, shit, I got last place. I'm telling you, these guys Damn. are good. I think they just get luck turned in their favor. 